This health beneficial monitor accessory now features RGB lighting that can aid your gaming experience with added immersion. Last year Quintus sent me their monitor light which has competed with the popular BenQ monitor light and has been attached to my computer monitor ever since. But now Quintus has sent another one of their monitor lights but this one is going to appeal to that flamboyant side of you that maybe wants to introduce a bit of RGB lighting into your setup. This is a dynamic RGB LED monitor light from Quintus. If you've already got one of these attached to your monitor like I do, then you probably already know the benefits of having one of these. But for those of you that don't, these are going to reduce eye strain caused by the long, arduous sessions of just staring at a computer screen by providing adequate lighting to both your screen and desk, especially during those long working hours where before you've noticed darkness has set in and all of a sudden you're working in the dark. If you notice that you get headaches, blurred vision or fatigue because of those long hours, you should probably try one of these because it's most likely affecting your productivity and well-being. It's about 40 centimeters long, it's made out of aluminium and it has an LED lamp at the top and bottom surface. The bottom desk lamp, which is designed for its number one objective of simultaneously illuminating both your desk and keyboard by emitting only light downwards, not towards your eyes, which is what the average lamp will do. And the top RGB lamp, which is designed to create that colorful ambient lighting behind your monitor. As you can see, the light module is fully tiltable to allow you to position the light exactly how you want it, thus creating a 45 degree asymmetrical light that's never gonna shine in your eyes and only on the desk in front of you. And as you can see, from the side view, the only area that's illuminated is everything within that 45 degree segment. On the sides of the light module, there's a touch control panel that lets you control each of the two functional lights independently, the white light and the RGB light. On the left side, marked with a W, a single press turns it on and a long press turns it off. To scroll through the customizations, a single press when it's on switches between the three color temperatures, warm white, natural white, and true white. A further quick two touch will cycle between the three different brightnesses, 100%, 50%, and 25%. The colour temperature and brightness that you do go for would depend on your preferences and obviously what time of day it is. On the right side, just like the left, the single press will turn it on and the long press will turn it off. And the single touch will now, when it's on, will cycle between the 15 RGB modes in three categories. So you've got monochrome with its one slow transition between all the colours, then seven static light choices. A dual color grade, which gives you six choices of two colors in a wave transition. And finally, the multi-color gradient, which cycles through all of the available colors in a nice transition. And it's actually the choice that I usually go for. The RGB light is meant to enhance your gaming experience by creating a more immersive experience. The lights produced are bright enough to create a noticeable glow behind your monitor, but not too bright to distract you from your game. Now, there is a non-removable 1.5 USB cable attached to the light module, which on more premium monitor lights, there is a USB-C slot and the cable is detachable. So depending on your setup and where your power outlets are, you may or may not struggle with that 1.5 meter cable. But if that's an issue, you can also purchase is cable extenders. This, like other monitor lights, is easy to install. The fixing clips design and that spherical bore means that fitting this moves away from the clamping style installation that many other monitor lights adopt, which sometimes tends to limit the type of monitors that they are actually compatible with. This one is suitable for all displays that are between one and three centimeters thick, but not for curved screens or laptops. As you can see here, it fits perfectly on my 27 inch monitor. The guard at the front hooks onto the screen, securing it from any backward movement, and the counterweight bore can can be positioned appropriately depending on your screen size. On the bore and the underside of the fixing clip, there is a rubber surface that creates this almost immovable object gripping force between the two surfaces, making it more secure. And then all you need to do now is position your light bore either up or down to suit your viewing angle, and you're ready to benefit from this in your setup. What do you think about how this monitor light looks in my setup? I think it definitely adds that sparkle with the addition of the RGB lighting. So who is this going to be for? This is gonna be a great product for any gamers, anyone who just wants to add some extra lighting and color into their own setup and doesn't want to buy those expensive wall RGB lights, especially to an area that's behind the monitor. It has features and functions 
functions that could make it versatile and beneficial for you by helping reduce your eye fatigue and helping improve your focus. It's not perfect and it may not be for everyone, but for the price and quality, I think it's worth a try. And at under $30 or pounds on Amazon, which is quite reasonable for a minus light, especially one with an RGB light as well, that's going to be a bargain. I'll leave a link to it in the description below. Thanks to Quintus for providing this minus light for me to review and show you. It's greatly appreciated. If you want to see the more premium minus light from Quintus, check out my review up there. I hope you found this video helpful and informative. If you did, please give it the video a thumbs up and subscribe to my channel for more videos just like this. And also let me know in the comments if something like this monitor light would be beneficial to you. I was skeptical before I tried one, now I can see the benefits of having one of these in my own setup. Thanks for watching and I'll see you in the next one.